Hello, welcome to Nutanix in two minutes or less. I'm your host, Eric Wamsley. I have just logged into my cluster as an admin account. You'll notice here on the home screen that there are four different distinct columns that provide information about your environment. This first column is more about what you have, what hypervisor, Prism Central, storage used and free, a summary of your virtual machines, including how many are on or powered off, and then even what hardware you're running, the number of nodes, and what models. The second column is your performance metrics, so things like storage, IOPS, latency, and bandwidth, and cluster-wide CPU and memory usage. The third column is your health and resiliency status. This health icon here actually changes colors based on the overall health of your environment. Thankfully, mine is green, and green is good, but in IT, we all know yellow is bad, and red is even worse. So, if your color of your heart is not green, you may want to check things out. And nicely, Nutanix has a scrollable option here of all different types of assets in your environment, so you can get a visual indication if something might be wrong. Below health is the data resiliency status, which lets you know if you can withstand hosts, drive, or other failures in your environment. And this is also clickable to give you more details. Since I'm running a one node cluster, my cluster cannot tolerate another node failure because there's only one. Hopefully you won't see that in your environment. The far right column is your warning and alerts. It lets you know if there's anything really bad specifically with your environment, such as a hard drive failure, a node down, or maybe a PSU that's out. Warnings could be other things like low storage. You also get informative alerts or how many events for when administrators are doing things in your environment. And that's a high-level overview of the home screen.